My name is Aaliyah Williams. I'm from Bronx, New York, and I'm in the SFS studying culture and politics. I'm Allison Forger. I'm from Monroe, Connecticut, and I'm at Georgetown studying Justice and Peace Studies and English. My name is Kendrick Beausoleil. I'm a sophomore in the college from Long Island, New York. I'm studying Justice and Peace Studies, thinking about minoring in education. My name is Yasmin Chowdhury, and um, I'm from Staten Island, New York. I am majoring in international politics with the concentration in international security. My name is Jelani Woods. I am from Newark, New Jersey, and I am studying psychology. My name is Cindy Chu. I'm from Bayside, Queens, and I'm studying finance and accounting, minoring in Chinese and bioethics. My name is Nikola Merkovich. I'm from Queens, New York City. I'm studying international economics and Arabic at Georgetown University. Georgetown has taught me a lot about myself and my identity. So I'm like a completely different person than I was um, before I came to Georgetown. So you think coming from New York, you've experienced it all and you've met people from all corners of the earth. But at Georgetown, you truly get the sense that the world is really big and there's so much that you haven't explored yet. When I pick my classes, it's the most, one of the most exciting times of the year because there are just so many new opportunities it is a, it's a bit more than I expected. I definitely expected the rigor to be where it is, but one thing I did not expect is for me to find a home on this campus, which I definitely do. I'm always constantly busy and just kind of trying to make the most of my time here at Georgetown, you know, try to use the resources that I have while I have them. The energy at Georgetown is, it can match New York City's energy. Everyone is so supportive. There's the real passion that helps people get through it. I think Georgetown has a culture of people who really embody the um, Jesuit value of like being a man and woman for others. Being here at Georgetown's kind of taught me to kind of take a step back, think about and consider other people's perspective, points of view, and that they are truly valid. If I could relive like the past two years, I would make all the friends all over again. I'd do that like in a heartbeat. The Georgetown culture happens to you a lot of the time, and I never thought that I would go out of my way to dance and then the Georgetown dancing culture just happened to me. The Wall Street Alliance has given, literally given me the opportunity to come to Georgetown. Hoyas definitely look out for other Hoyas. I know like once I graduate that I'd want to do exactly the same like what the Wall Street Alliance has done for me. Like I want to be able to do the same for other students. If not for the Wall Street Alliance scholarship, I would have probably gone to a city school where I would not have been exposed to the same people the same opportunities as I am here. The biggest chunk of my financial aid has come from the Wall Street Alliance and I don't know what I would have done without that. There would have been no way for me to be here. The vast majority of my life in these four years is at Georgetown, so the vast majority of my life, I guess, is funded by the generous people in New York. Even if I don't know you personally, if you're a Hoya, I already know that we have a relationship because we have shared this experience on the hilltop. You get to trust that the world will kind of come together to make this happen for you, but you have to do the best that you can with it once you do get here, because it is a privilege to be here. That money's going somewhere great, because we're all here at Georgetown working hard. We understand the opportunity that we've been afforded, so we're out here to shake things up. And I've learned so much, but I still feel like I have a very long ways to go. I see my sister, she's five, she's in kindergarten. I see her looking up to me and going, you know, I'm gonna go to Georgetown. I'm gonna be like my sister. And that's something amazing, you know? I'm definitely proud to be a Hoya. It's one of the greatest accomplishments in my life, and it's something that I will take with me for the rest of my life.